Welcome back, warlocks, I guess, or old school shooters, or old school shooter fans, I should say. This is Papa Bearcat, and we are back in the uh, Project Warlock, and I have missed a couple of uh, my uh, old school Sundays, because one of them was me and my wife's anniversary. The second one was just that I had other things to do, and I didn't have time to record, and... I can't remember what I capacity there we go do I have any points in there no okay well I can't really remember where I was so hopefully I do okay all right if I remember correctly this uh industrial levels are kind of a pain in the butt or kind of tough Napalm rockets or supersonic rockets as far as ultra high speed rockets. Hmm. Close range fire spreading device or a mix of stream. A accurate stream, I guess. <clears throat> Let's go for the rockets just because. That sounds cool. Never had the uh, ultra ultrasonic rockets before. <clears throat> there goes my throat again. All right. Well, let's see where I was. Oh, I'm at the boss. Hmm. Well, I guess we have to be ready for this. Where's my rocket launcher? There it is. I got some rounds, so hopefully I do good. I got 24 lives. I don't have full health, but I'm close. And I don't have full ammo. Alright. I never fought this boss before, so this is completely 100% new to me, guys. So, wish me luck. Are you psyched? Get psyched. The tank. Yeah, I've never made it here before. So this is completely new to me. Well, I see it down there. You see that? I feel like I may die several times. Whoa. I like the supersonic rockets. Okay. I didn't even get hit once, guys. That was, like, super easy. I don't know if it was the supersonic rockets that helped me out with it, but... Yeah, that was not that difficult. This music, though, what the heck? Usually these boss levels don't have secrets. And if they do, I usually miss them, but most of the time, if I remember correctly, that they don't actually have any secrets, so... Well, he wasn't that bad. It's probably the easiest boss out of them all, to be honest. He didn't even fire his guns, he just kind of kept sliding towards me. <laughs> I don't know if it's supposed to be like that. Alright, what am I going to now? Oh. Treasure room? Alright, okie dokie, that was easy. That kind of put me through a loop there for a moment, like, what happened? Okay. Yeah, no secrets. The demons are getting too strong for your liking. They now have the power to wipe out whole cities and slaughter entire armies. If they really are so dangerous, you're the only one powerful enough to stand in their way. You've battled waves and vile creatures, faced odds stacked heavily against you, and come out as an unstoppable killing machine. A smile crosses your face as you realize your destination, hell. The source of all the world's evil will be utterly destroyed in a rush of blood, guts, flames, and gunfire. 
by the end of the by the end of it you will be the most powerful man in history you almost wish you could keep killing forever <clears throat> are they saying that he's uh stronger than the uh, doom guy <coughs> excuse me but uh he can't be stronger than doom guy doom guy was like ultimate right perk point available set point available upgrade point available all right a little of everything we do have a point here but we do have a point as well here what should i do life spirit strength capacity life because i do not know what i'm getting into this new this uh next episode i do not know anything about it at all ever want to become a leg farmer all animal smg and pistol minigun uh, smg and uh, pistol ammo pickups provide extra bullets so you can show them where your farm is okay explosive ammo crates give you extra fuel dynamite rockets and cells this one is kind of sounding kind of good because the uh, ultrasonic rockets were pretty awesome not really big on the cell, the uh, the gun that uses the cells, which is what the rail gun or whatever it's called. I can't remember. All make us heal plus five more health when picked up. That would be useful too. That's all make us too. Let's get this one. Yeah. All right. Nobody knows the drill. And every time you come back here, who keeps replacing the health and stuff? Weird. All right, four points here. Oh, wrong button again. All right, I guess we're going on to the next stage here. I'd never been to this stage before, which is hell. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> Hellish Castle, the Lord of Hell. Hellish. Oh, castle, Antarctica, Egypt. Shore, <laughs> the shores of hell. <laughs> ah, doom reference. Lord of hell. Well, I guess I'm ready. Whenever you guys are ready. Get sacked. That that tank boss was a little too easy. Is that a well a soul eater? Did those things launch the eyeballs? What is that? Treasure? A curse spell is now available. Curse spell. Tapeworm. Where was I didn't even see the tape for him. Oh, there it is. Was it invisible? No, those tape forms are invisible. Jeez, man. What is these? Treasure, ammo. Okay, this level is a bit creepy. Oh, there's a tape worm. Wreck it. Oh. Wow. So you gotta use your uh, target right there. You have to, uh, they're in, well, I guess they're underground or invisible one. But you have to look at your, like your target and at the top of the screen it'll show that you are targeting something and then that's how you see them. Bam! Whoa, what was that? Whoa! They're shooting rockets, what the heck? I met, I met those uh, ones at the beginning of the game. I don't even know what they were called. Some, uh, succubus or whatever? <clears throat> What? Whoa. 
This guy's just come out of nowhere. Oh, found a secret. Is this a... Yep, succubus. But I thought I met him before already. Like at the very beginning of the game. Oh, you blew yourself up. Yeah. Calm down with the rockets, man. Whoa, what is that? Oh, these are like, uh... Cyber demons, but really, really small. <laughs> oh, what is that? Ew. It's gross. Oh, it's hatching these things. Go away. Already at the exit, huh? Woo. I'm not done in this level yet. As you can tell, I just found the exit and literally just started this level not long ago. I need the blue key. Try to make sure to look, find the secrets. Because secrets are where all the good stuff is, usually. Oh, okay, so these, whoa, these are mana, and the red face is the health. Okay, now we know. I knew that looked a little different. I'll say this level's giving me the heebie-jeebies. Bam! Go down. Nope. Whoa, no rockets. No rockets. The flame shotgun seems to be doing really good here. Well, I know you're over there, dude. You can't be hiding from me. Get out of here. If the if the if an invisible spot starts burning, there's an enemy there. Good tip for you guys. <laughs> All right, new door there. Blue doors everywhere. Hey, um, hello. Oh. Wow, an old enemy. I haven't seen these guys in quite some time, actually. Whoa. Zambies. We don't say the Z word. It's disrespectful. <laughs> Sad. Wow, they just keep coming, don't they? Hey, you hit me. Hell. Oh, I guess you did. I still got my crossbow. I will use that if I have to. Oh, dang, I keep getting stuck on all this uh, scenery, if you will. Yeah, flame shotgun is where it's at. This thing actually does some work. Wasn't I already in here? Yes, I was. I got in here using a secret. So this was useless to me. Okay, let's go find another blue door then. Thought that was at least one more somewhere. Maybe I was wrong. I guess I was. Hmm, I thought that was at least one more blue door. Okay, that's two out of two secrets, 108 kills, 52 items. The battleground. Don't shoot your rockets. Oh, not the big. Oh, man. 
Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Talk about being in the heat of the, the moment there. Woo. What with the rockets, man? Wow. I just got gang ganged up on pretty bad. I see you over there. You, oh, you, ah, oh, it just keeps going. Gross. He fell over and turned into a blob butthole. <laughs> I don't know. That was gross. Blobbed a butthole. Hey, hey. Calm it down over there. This gun does okay amount of damage, but it's, it damages me, that's why I don't like using it. I shouldn't upgrade it to this. But I like the ricochet effect, though, because you can shoot around a corner. But the shots always seem to come right back at you again. There's a lot of ammo and stuff out here. And there's a switch. A Nintendo Switch. Alright. <laughs> Whoa. Those tapeworm dudes, they just pop out of nowhere, don't they? Jump scares, right? What is up with my gun right here? Weird. There's like a glitch in that, that corner there, of that uh, door. The worst secrets, the ones that are filled with enemies. This level, it looks like one of those one levels that um, more you do, you traverse, more open it becomes, which can be a bit scary. Who's in here? <laughs> I knew there was something going to happen. I just knew it. I called it. Make sure to pick up all this ammo that's being left around. There's a but look at all this ammo. It's just it's everywhere. Is that supposed to be like the the bull demon or the pinky, as I always called it from Doom? Okay. How you getting there? A secret, maybe? Alright, let's go find the, uh, the switch. There it is. It's probably gonna open up some big area. Oh, there's three of them. Ew. Any secret right here? No. Why would there be a secret? It's not like it looks like a secret. Now I'm looking for two more of those Nintendo Switches. <laughs> ah, cracked myself up. Funny joke, right? Oh, treasure. Alright, any Switches in here? On this wall? No, no. Well, I, have, I got a blue, blue key, so let's go find ourselves a blue door. Oh, we got this door. Look at these walls. It, that's just a huge waste of ammo right there.
la 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 <laughs> quit coming back at me man this looks like a big door that will open if I hit probably that third switch and this one too That doesn't count as one of the normal switches. That's a different switch. Oh, yellow key. Any tapeworms? That's hiding. Oh, I saw something. There it is. Oh, there's a couple of them. I see. Oh. Yeah, that's abomination, all right. Look at it, it turns into a butthole. <laughs> Gross, man. Sidestepping, your best friend. Sidestepping has always been your best friend in these old style FPS games. Always utilize them at their best ability, if that makes any sense. Alright, yellow door. A yellow door. Whoa. No. You will receive upgrade point. Uh, sidestepping really saves your bacon when it comes to dodging all these uh, rockets and whatnot. They really do help. Get close to the wall that bites you. Looks feels like I'm missing something in this room. I'm not ready to exit just yet. There it is. Because there's still one more switch to find, wasn't there? Like this. And it probably opens this. I wonder, does this game have um, the secret exits? Like most FPSs back in the day? Ah, there it is. What, there's still one to go? I thought I had one left. Dang it. feel lost looking at all the walls wondering if these uh, switches I gotta find lead to a, a, a secret exit or something Kinda of curious now. If I just keep walking around the circles here, where would it be? Ew. Didn't notice those mouths, notice those mouths, but these mouths though. Yum. <laughs> What if the, you get you touch the wall and it just bites you and you're like, oh man, what the heck? And it takes half your health. That would be awful. All right, I am missing something here. Hmm, I 
I've been in everything, at least I thought I was. Eyeballs. Makes me wonder what how am I missing this uh switch so bad? I'm missing it like completely. Now it's gonna be in the spot that was in the open too. It'll be like, oh man, really? Man, I can't stop yawning today. That's like the third time I've yawned since I started this uh, episode. Yeah, I've been away for a little bit on the old, old school Sundays. Hope you guys didn't miss me too much. <laughs> right? Yeah, you guys just missed me way too much. Where is this other switch, man? Like, I really don't want to leave without finding it. But I've been in literally every room except in here. At least I thought I have been. That would be nice to know how many secrets I have left. I do believe the uh, Dusk, that game made by, uh, what's that, uh, man, I can't remember his name now. Not Holschold, he's the one who did the music for Dusk. Like David Alshray or something like that, weird name. Cool game, by the way. Well, look at this right here, why does my gun get all weird? Am I like looking through the map? Can't remember if any of these switches was in a secret already. I literally just have one switch left. Now how is it so difficult to find this particular switch? not a very big level man I can't just hang around here forever gotta move on you know yeah, it was worth a try And that switch is kind of small too, so it's going kind of going to be hard to find. Just a little bit. I have a feeling that this level was one of those uh, levels that's just supposed to restock you up for the next level, which is probably going to be a little bit more difficult, or a lot more difficult. All right, okay. If I can't find this switch, I'm just going to move on. I have a feeling I probably walked by it like a hundred, hundred times. Ah, or no? That's not much of a secret. Now, ah, is this one right here? No. The other one was different colored like that, but apparently that one does not count. Man, I am yawning a, a bunch. Like a lot yawning. Well, I haven't slept yet, so... I've just been up. I couldn't sleep. So I was like, I'm gonna go ahead and record my next episode while I'm at it. 
Yeah, I think I might move on, but I don't. I want to know what's back there. What is up with this sky? What the heck? Weird. I think I might move on. I can't hang in one level way too long. I would like to know what's back there though. It's probably a secret exit. And if this game has secret exits like Doom, where you go to a hidden secret level in each episode or something, I've missed all of them. I want to move on. Sadly, I'm going to move on. Yep, three out of four secrets. I did miss one. I probably had the the uh, switch in it. All right, guys. Well, I made it to the workshop again. And if you have watched my previous Project Warlock episodes, you know that when I make it to the workshop, it is the end of the episode. And then we'll move on to the next level. What is the next one? We got a hellish Antarctica. You. All right. Well, guys, if you enjoyed the content and the video and my company, consider hitting that subscribe button and joining up. Help you know help out my channel. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers before August 22nd. That is my deadline for YouTube. And uh, when that happens, then I'll be able to get monetized and I can actually help pay the bills so I can run this channel I know it sounds really scummy of me to say that but it's true you know this stuff ain't free and uh, if you guys like to see new content on my channel I can't buy new games without any money you know you don't just give you're just not giving to me for free so all right and uh, if you like my commentary find it helpful funny or entertaining hit that like button to show you support that like button it means a great deal to me because every time you guys hit that like button YouTube recommends my content to new new people. More people are able to see it on YouTube in searches and whatnot. So it really does help me out. And in the uh, next time subscribe button, you'll see a bell icon. You hit that bell icon, then you become part of the Meerkat Nation notification squad. When that happens, you get notifications for everything I upload as Old School Sunday or Minecraft or my Borderlands Road to Borderlands 3 let's play of all the games and anything in the future so so you don't miss any of these awesome adventures all right guys well each and every one of you have an awesome day playing these retro games back in or like those retro style or retro games from the 90s and i'll see you later bye bye